Hey, hello, good morning everyone. I just want to do a video here where I tell about some of the amazing new things God is doing and what is going to happen, especially in America. Before I will start with that, I will say two things. First thing, granddaddy Torben Sundergaard. Granddaddy Torben Sundergaard. I have just become a granddaddy. It's so amazing. Two days ago, our amazing son and daughter-in-law got a little boy, David. It got prophesied by a few people. They got words that his name should be David. I love that. So I now have a grandson called David. It's a blessing. It's amazing. Little beautiful boy. We got him. They got him two days ago, and uh, and I'm so happy. And I still need to get used to that title. Suddenly I am old with gray hair, or oh, not so much gray hair. But it's a blessing to have a family who love Jesus and who want to serve Him and who love each other and, and, and to serve God as a family. So me and my wife are so blessed and uh, it, it's just amazing. Another thing I want to say that is the 15th of July today. In seven days, Saturday, the 22 of July, in one week from today, we are going to release the Seven Days Adventure with God movie. It's going to come out for free on YouTube. So in seven days, the 22 of July, you can see the Seven Days Adventure with God movie for free on YouTube. And uh, we're going to share it on Facebook and all over the place, of course, and, and emails if you are signed up on our website, lastreformation.com, to receive news. You're going to get it as soon as it's out. We're going to send an email out there also. So I just want to say it's amazing. It's, it's, I look so much forward to that because we, we showed it again when I was in Florida and America a week ago and people were so touched by it. And I really believe that this movie is going to make a big, big impact all over the world. It's going to come out with 30 sub uh, subtitles, different languages there. And, and I, I really believe it's going to be big. So pray for that and expect great things and be ready to Saturday next week in seven days when the movie comes out so you can see it with your friends and family and share it so many more people can get touched and learn and and and, and hear the, see what the real life is about so they can come in and live the life we all call to live a life with god a life that is an adventure when that is said i also have a lot of things because god is doing so much more all over the place and we were just in florida a month ago no a week ago sorry and it was it was strong. God did amazing thing. Maybe you have seen the the video of the girl who got healed with the neck brace. Honda and sixty thousand have seen it on 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 Facebook in a few days, and it, it is beautiful. But and we baptize over ninety people. But it's continuing, and it's continuing not only there all over the place because it's discipleship. Discipleship. The fruit is not only when we are there. The fruit is when we are gone. What is happening when we are gone? How do people continue living this life? And there we have amazing testimony to tell. And you can also see that in the seven days of Adventure with God, where we actually in the end follow up on what has happened since we were in Brazil. But you see that in the movie. Uh, but what was special in, uh, in, in um, America this time was that <clears throat> uh, different things happened. Um, some of the things happened was that I saw everything come together as God had been prophesying and, and speaking to me about some years ago. Because some years ago I was in Switzerland and I stood there out on the street doing a kickstart and suddenly somebody came to me and said, can we pray for you? Somebody from the kickstart, who was at the kickstart. And they came and said, yeah, you can pray for me. And they started to prophesy over me and they prophesied very, very clear. I would say it's one of the clearest prophecy I ever got. It was, I was amazed because it was like in details what, what God had already been speaking to me about and, and what had been happening. And, and the words, one of the words uh, I got was that we are going to start five different hubs all over the world. And those hubs will be like an airport where planes are landing, getting fuel and flying out again. 
And uh, you know that we have the Jesus Hotel here in Denmark, and and it's really amazing to have our place. And and we see now that Jesus Hotel had been our pioneer training school, but now it become a pioneer leadership school, a three month school. Um, but we also have different pioneer training schools that start all over the place. There is in Holland, there is in in Switzerland, there is in Canada, America. They've been running, and uh, most of those schools are are mobile schools and, and they're a little smaller than the Jesus Hotel. And we love it and we believe that the Pioneer Training Schools is going to explode all over the world. That every country is going to have their own Pioneer Training School or two. Because it's smaller, it's simple, it's uh, mobile schools or it can be mobile schools. And, and you don't need so many people to start it. You can start it and, and make disciples. But we see that the Jesus Hotel has been very important for people because what you get at the Jesus Hotel you don't get at some of the mobile schools is you get a home. Because the Jesus Hotel is like a home where you have been, you have been trained and you know the place, you know the area, you know the people. And then you go out in the harvest and it's amazing but it's sometimes hard and it's often hard and it's good to just come home again for a short time to get some rest for then to be sent out again and when it's a mobile home you don't have that place to go to where you can find rest where you know the place you know the beds you know the area you know the people and and right away feel i'm home again and find rest and to be sent out and this is what the cheese hotel is is special with <clears throat> and this is what God wants us to start in five different countries, like a hub, like a Jesus center, like the Jesus hotel. And we are now going to start in Florida. Yeah! Everything has just come together, it's starting to come together, it's not everything come together yet, but it's starting and we saw when we were in Florida. There was people with us who had been following the last of Messing for years and there was new people who came too who are really who are really on board on this and, and, and want to help to set it up. And, and, and something that also happened in Florida, on the way to Florida, um, let's say like that, okay. The last two, three months, we have not had a lot of extra money. It has been a little challenge uh, sometimes to, to, to pay the things we need to pay and, and things just cost. And it has been a, in a li little challenge uh to do that um but but I, I i was out praying a week before florida and say god you are faithful you are faithful you are faithful and you have said that you send somebody to bless us and to help us so we can get the gospel out and so on then on the way to florida me and robert we sat in detroit airport and we started to talk about the new movie that we want to give the movie out for free online and it costs Forty, fifty thousand dollars sometimes to do a movie, especially the last Reformation movie. This movie is cheaper, and and we want to give it out for free. We want to think out of the box. We don't want to to do like many other people uh, do. We want to do it this way. We feel we should just give it out and bless, bless, bless. But but then we felt something crazy. We should not only give it out for free. We 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 should come to that place where we can send it out for free. Actually, buy DVDs and send it out, <laughs> shipping, free. And, 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 and it costs a lot of money. But, but we just felt God was in it. And I'm like, come on, I, we didn't have, we, we have not had anything extra the last three months. We, we have been like really down. And, and, and now God said we should do something like that. Like, come on, it's crazy. If, 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 it, if there's, it costs $5 per DVD to send out, if, if there is, 10,000 who want a free DVD, and we already now don't have anything extra. But I felt it was God, I became so excited. I, I felt like I was jumping around and I was like, oh, this is scary, this is a scary thought. I, I became like, this is scary, and I became almost nervous, but I felt God was in it. So it says to Robert, Robert, we do it, we do it. This is God, we need to do this. And then in America, when we started up, uh, there was actually somebody who came to bless us and, and I don't know exactly how much I'm going to get uh, but there came a person who wanted to bless us with money and, and we're talking about um, we're talking about a lot of money to help 
to get this DVD out, to ship it out for free. And, and, and it, it became really a strong thing for me that, that hey, there is actually somebody who wants to help with this. And, but we can do it even cheaper if we get registered in America with the 5.0 or something. You who are in America, you know it. If we get registered as an organization in America, there is things we can do with shipping where it's much cheaper. And, and we want to do more of that and we need a lot of more money also to, to, to continue ship it out, to continue give things out, to continue to create movies and, and do that. So I just felt like God said, now is the step. You need to be registered in America as an organization. You need to get the 5-0 or something number so people also can bless and give to you in America. And so we can give, get cheaper shipping so we can actually get this out to many, many people. And it's time to start a Jesus Hotel in Florida. And it just came so strong and we're like, this is now, this is now, this is what God had been saying. So we are going to start a Jesus Hotel in Florida. We're going to start a hub, one of the five hubs God wants to start all over the world. We're going to start a center. We don't know exactly where we are thinking about um, uh, West Palm Beach, Orlando, it's further down maybe actually Jupiter, down there, I don't know exactly where, and, but we know God is in control. I'm doing this video to say play, pray for us, but also if there's people out there in Florida who already, maybe you have a building, maybe you have something that were like, hey, this is exactly, this is what God have been thinking for the Jesus Hotel in Florida, for the hub, for the center. Or maybe you have money and you have business and you want to help to set this up. If you have something special, you can give them, contact me and uh, or the last information and get hold of me and I can put you in contact with our friends in Florida and we can get this starting. The idea is that me as a family, me and my family is then going to go to America for a few months and help to set this up because if I see the Jesus Hotel in Denmark, it's going really good. It's going good and, and I'm, I was there much more in the beginning. I'm not so much more there. Right now with students and staff, there is 93 people this weekend. 93 people at the Jesus Hotel right now. And I actually not been there until now. And there are amazing people, amazing staff, amazing people who are doing a so good a job. And I can see it can, oh, it can run without me. It's really going good now. And, and we want to help to set that up in America. Not to be dependent on us, but just to help to set it up. And therefore we will go to America maybe a month or two with some of our friends and, and start to do a pioneers school or maybe a pioneer leadership school and gather people around Florida and then set that up. So from Florida we can send people up, up out all over America to do Kickstarter weekends, to do pioneer training schools. And for them when they, they're not tired, if they need a rest, they always have a home where they can come back in Florida and, and feel like this is home. I'm, I'm back here, I get new energy, I get filled up and then out again. Like an airport, planes is landing, getting fuel and then flying out again. So this is the idea. So God had really blessed us on that trip in Florida. God spoke to us about taking new steps in faith and shipping things out for free. And we already got a lot of money for that. I know we need so much more, but God is in control. God is in control with the building. God is in control with everything. And I'm, I'm doing this video, if you have in your heart, and it, it maybe God has spoke to you about doing something in Florida, and maybe you have a building you can give. Maybe you have money and contacts of things, and you say, hey, I've been following the last week of May, I want to be part of, of these new things God is starting in Florida. Then let us know, and, and please pray for us. It's going to be amazing. So uh, I'm so excited about how things come together. And, and, and some have asked us like two, three years ago, why didn't we get registered as a church or organization, what is called in America? And, and I think it was a good idea, but, but we don't work on good ideas. We work on God's ideas. And I don't want to do anything if it's not for God. And, 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 and I want to, we want to work with him. We want to do what he's saying. 
and it just came so clear this time that this is what God wants us to do to to help to spread the work of God in America and uh, then we go for it uh, so it's so beautiful so a big blessing from here I hope you got something out of that video if you are living in the area of Florida or maybe another place in America and you want to help to set this up and get this started and also if, if, if maybe with, with buildings or or finances or other things or or you you know how to set that up uh, or things something just contact me <laughs> you can do it through lastreformation.com uh, and then I'll put you in contact with also some of those people we know already there and uh, maybe you're going to meet us and be one of the first staff at the Pioneer Leadership School or the Teach Hotel in Florida that would be amazing so a big blessing from here love it Bye bye. Hey, just one more thing. I'm going to Poland, the capital in Poland, in the middle of August. Come and join there if you can. I'm going to London, England, in the middle, in the beginning of September, and in the end of September to Rio in Brazil. So if you can, come and join there. God bless you. Bye bye.